Oi. Welcome to Soul Slinger, Envoy of Death, a new roguelike shooter in early access. Like pretty much every other roguelike shooter I've played recently, like Witchfire, like Ripout. Well, Remnant 2 was in early access, but this is what this should be more so. I played the demo already. I have the gameplay up of that. I'm guessing we're going through the same part as in the demo. At the end of the video, I'm gonna show you the early access roadmap they had put on Steam. But first, we're gonna go into the cutscene and then we're gonna shoot things up. Continue. Wait a minute. Did that just freeze everything? Or does it mean I can continue from the beta? Ha! Huh. Look at that, a game of actual progression. Ah yeah, real old timing. Good. So this means that the demo upgrade they actually let you have the progression you've unlocked through the demo. So I um, progressed through this part. This game by the way was 16 euros at the moment, or 17. Ah, flaming barrier, explosive bullets. What just like? Guess this is not the intro. Then, hey, what the hell is this? I need to check my dash. Okay, good. Ah, let's see what's over there. If I even can get over there, oh, I got it. Yeah, guess this is part two now. Guess this is part two. Demo is part one. A lot of people watch that demo, so I feel like I can leave it like that. Hmm. Nothing yet. Can't go through here, I can't shimmy through, can jump over. Okay. There's no sprint, there's only dash. There's no climb. The art style is very washed out and colorless. For the world at least. That kind of surprised me. Now I'm asking myself, do I want to start from the start? Okay, there you see bosses when you get a boss. So there are a few changes here. Ah, uh, aren't there supposed to be people spawning? There they are. Yep, that hurt me. I didn't like the shotgun too much and I need to get used to the game again. The hell are you doing over there? Damn it, reload. Let's see. <laughs> Oh, that's unfortunate. Okay. At least it doesn't screw me over. There are so many roguelike shooters at the moment that are in early access. And insane. Oh, that's not good with a shotgun. Okay. This one. You can play with controller from what I've seen. Tears. Blazing Essence, Soul Essence, I don't know what everything does at the moment. As you can see down below, what's up? I need to be better with my dodges and my reloads. And my hitting shots. Damn it! Up the ball. I don't even remember, remember those enemies. Okay, I mean, I guess so give you heal your stuff. And resistance. Go! Damage resistance. Electric! And tears of oblivion. Let's go electric. Um, 
guessing the boss fight I did in the demo twice is the boss fight we're gonna encounter here. Okay. Oh boy, that many. I'm stuck. Ooh. Get the focus. The focus good. Gotta work with jumping a lot. I see the tears up here. Okay. Ooh, lightning. I don't just dash that much. I want lightning strike. Electricity. Damn it. Did I get it? I got it. Gotta look for those orbs, I guess. A little bit at least. Okay, more portals. The quick early access roadmap sum up is more levels are gonna come. More arenas weapons bosses more uh, senses or something like that a sense what are you blueprint i want that with a blue bread oh, i want the blue brain um turn down the music a little bit Still haven't tried all. Oh, that's fire. Fire burns. Lightning. Ah, there it is. It stuns them too. I didn't think I hit any of that. And walk through the fire. That didn't hit. Damn it. Okay. I was getting used to that. Used to all. Ambo of dreams. Electric essence. I sworn there was more to collect here. But yeah, the arenas are a little. Not that big. And I don't know. A lot of exploding tour barrels. Look at that. Did that do anything? That did stuff. Oh boy, who dropped this? On oh gold. Everything very western inspired. I'm guessing since the early access roadmap is quite big. So this, this is what they were hoarding. Will be quite short at the start. Amber. Ambers. Let's go for that. I don't know what is good. Yeah. I wanted to turn my music down a little bit, it gets to me already. Oh. Yeah. Right before bossy. Electricity rocks. Ah, oh, damn it. I just get hit. Healing is weird. Healing is weird. I believe they are. That's the boss. That's the shop. That's the tears. Let's go shopping. Let's see if we can find something that puts my hub up. Ah, there's no intro cutscene. And turn my face come on again. Rup. Nope. You. Hello. Okay. So, what does Dead Eyes Emporium have on offer today? Depends on what Master Envoy has in his coin purse. No. Intro again. Uh, 
Okay. Well, it's detonates. Yeah, in one amber of dreams. Don't know what you are used for. Don't have enough for you. No, no touching the gold, savvy. Okay. Let's get that done. Thank you for shopping Deadeye McGee's Emporium. Emporium. An envoy's work is never done. Use flash, damn it. Wrong button. So many exploding things here. Damn. Hey. Oh boy. I'm getting mauled. That's not what I wanted at all. Jump! The half a little bit. Boss like that. Not health, damn it. Oh. Mm. Death's office. Yes, death's office, please. Maybe it's health for me. Maybe the death has health for me. Let's go in. I'm avoiding the boss fight. I mean, I don't have enough health, anyways. I saw you could use some help. I could. Oh. No. I don't have healing powers. What for death spell? Huh. Ah. Uh. Nope. That's where I drive. So, electric essence, I need life essence, barely. Barely. Otherwise, I will have a lot of dying. I don't hate any of that. Oh boy. Close. The hell was that? A big boy! Oh boy, that... was that? Damn it! Oh no! Ah. That timing! Damn you! Damn you! He does. little bit screwed oh sparks please emporium yeah i gotta go for the boss i don't have high hopes for my survival rate though Oop. i just loaded in nicely this is the same boss ah uh, yeah those two dudes i'm going through you can't stop me i survived them twice already probably 
Damn it. Job me. Nice job me. Okay, that's the death done. You have fallen. You have fallen. I didn't die in the demo. Oh, okay. Okay. What now? Oh, I need to go for the same level again. Damn you. Not sure I'll ever get used to this. Hey, little one. Oh, shh, it's okay. I didn't mean to scare you. Where'd you come from anyway? Guess that makes us neighbors then. Huh. What's your name? Is something wrong? She don't talk. I am so sorry. You can't speak. Who did this to you? Who's there? Oh, no, uh, hey, wait. Huh. Ah, yeah. uh, and now after the cutscene, even though I should have done it beforehand, that's where I came out from. This lady. Mind if I join you? I have to get back in the field after I'm finished with this. So. What does death have you doing anyway? You don't think the cartel goons are the only threats to souls out there, do you? Limbo's a very big place. And there's always someone ripping open souls for power because they want more. Uh, there was a little girl hanging around in the path when I got back. What's her deal? I know the child you mean. She visits sometimes. She's been here a while. Helen. Her name is Helen. Well, uh, I'll leave you to it. What the hell was that blurry transition? Oh boy. Blurry transition. Well, of tears, do I get something wrong for that? Healing shrine. Oh, that's something I would actually need. Gunslinger, are you dash damage resistance? Uh, Damn, there's so much. Office for 41, and that costs. Do I have that already? Or do I just not have enough stuff? Unlock, unlock. Okay, got it. Don't have enough for probably yeah. anything here. Yeah. Steph not here? Oh, here he is. Let's talk to the big boy. I uh, remember waking up after you put me back together. It's uh, still the first actual memory I have of being dead, other than those flashes I keep having. That is to be expected. Consciousness and memory improve when a soul's form is stable, or when its injuries have healed further. Not fast enough, if you ask me. Still, I owe you for saving me, even if it might have just been to get another envoy in your service. It was not. I would have healed you regardless, as I've healed all these other souls roaming here. Including the little girl? Yes. I have a duty to the souls of the dead. One I take very seriously. Continue your mission. Inform me at once if your flashes reveal new memories. Otherwise, for your own safety, I'd refrain from pursuing them any further. Oh, that blurry transition. 
and a shaky tree. Don't think I can go through here, start up. Up. Up, something is making the game start up. Probably death. Death is very powerful. Workshop, I don't like the shotgun, I feel like ah, oh, the pistol was better. The crafting gear. Double barrel fury. Britain's missing. I'm glad to die. Ha! <laughs> hey, alright. Without missing a shot. So forge. I can only craft that. Ah! Uh, that just makes me see stuff. Already crafted the equip. There's that down there. I don't know. Not really feeling inspired. Okay, that's over here. Let me show you the roadmap. Holy access roadmap. Me screen recording. Here we go. Early access roadmap. The next update, the big one, should be in March, apparently. New essence. I believe those are spells and stuff. I don't quite know what are upgrades. Type of buff. A new arena in the land of memories. Including a secret cavern containing a new craftable item. That's more so a small one. And then we have some bigger ones. Adding the first half of the new realm. Outskirts. Six to seven new arenas. New essence. Five new enemies. A new boss. Then this one is in June. Then in September. Second half. Outskirts, new arenas, new weapons, new enemies, new boss. Guarding the final realm, adding survival room challenges, and that's pretty much all they have. The full release they didn't say. That's a little bit. 16 euros on Steam. Out now. Apparently not on my page right now. And um, yeah, that's the goddamn souls going up. I will play here and there a little bit. Slowly. It's Christmas time, but this stuff is also important. Ah, result. <laughs>